Okay, first off, I'd like to take a moment to dedicate this video right here to a good friend of ours who just recently passed away. His name was Lee. He lived a few doors down from us. Me, him, and Dee all shared plenty of memories together, so he will be missed. And my condolences sincerely to his family, who we got to meet the other day as I picked up some of his stuff. He was a great guy, and it's a blessing to have been on a planet with a guy as good as Lee was. He was a, a son, a father, a relatively amazing person, and I truly appreciate all you guys sticking in there. And just, if you could, in the comment section, send some love for his family, all that cool stuff. Now let's get into the video. Hell yeah. Okay, so what I'm doing today is I'm unboxing a K1 Interstellar Personal Humanoid Scout Robot. It's super awesome. Dee and me ordered it the other day. As you guys may or may not know, Dee is really into robotics. He's got plenty of stuff over here. As you can see, all the wires and cool stuff. This is one of our personal favorites. Let me go ahead and grab that real quick. But all these different servos and stuff. He builds robotic, really robotic cool stuff. So I respect him for that. And so he found this online. He was like, I got to have it. So we found the very last one. And we had to order it from GameStop and it came today. We ordered it three days ago and it came in three days. So I'm gonna unbox it. Dee's out at work. So I'm gonna go ahead and unbox it and show you guys exactly what we got here. So stick in there and enjoy the video. Smash like, all that cool stuff. Yeah. Okay guys, so what we have down here is a box that was delivered today. So I'm gonna go ahead and slice it open with my handy dandy knife right here and be super careful. Let's go ahead and cut it open. I know how much people love to see unboxings on YouTube. So let's see exactly what we have in here. I'm kind of excited. The company's name is Robosen, and I hope I said that right. Here's exactly what came with it, with the receipt and all that. So let's push this out of the way. Here is a Robosen K1 Interstellar Personal Humanoid Robot. Here is the box. Here's what it looks like, guys. I hope everybody can see it well. I'll get it from both cameras right here. That's what it looks like, that's the front, that's the side, the side, the back, and the side. There it is, right there you guys. So we're gonna have, go ahead and kick this thing open real quick. If I can figure out how to do that in a jiffy. Let's go ahead and get this box out of the way. Another super stellar case right here. It has the Robosin logo on the front, if you can see that. Super awesome, and these two things on the side. I'm pretty sure those are locks to keep the front from uh, popping open. So I'm going to go ahead and lay this down on the ground. Maybe I'll get one of the cameras closer so you can see the close up right here as I go ahead and open this. I open it upside down, but here it is, guys. Here is the Robosyn K1 Interstellar Personal Humanoid Robot. Long ass name that you'll never be able to remember. But look how cool that thing is. I'm going to try to be careful and pull him out of here. Let's go ahead and get set them up here real quick so I can get it from behind. <laughs> oh man, how cool is that thing? Oh wow. Let's see if we can get them up on the counter. Stand them up. Uh, will he stand up by himself? It's kind of hard to do this one handed. I'm going to go ahead and put this down. Whoa, this is awesome. This is so amazing. Yeah, Robo Dancing. Oh, I'm sure once we figure out exactly what's going on here. Let me see what else is in the box. See if he'll stand here by himself. Okay, what else is in the box? There's this thing. There's a cord. It looks like a DC outlet cord right here. And another wire, USB wire. What's this thing on the side right here? This is a Robosyn book right here. You guys see that? I suppose this is a manual. Open this up and it'll probably tell you how it works and there's a manual in here and cool stuff. Interstellar Scout Robot right here. Product specification. Yep, it's a manual. It tells you how it works and everything. Robot programming, how to program it, Bluetooth, disclaimers, all this cool stuff. So, uh, plug this in right there and see if it'll move or turn on. Let's see what happens when we plug it in. Go ahead and get that plugged in right there. Where's the plug for this thing? In the back? Oh yeah. Okay, so it's plugged in, but I don't know exactly what that means. There's a power switch. 
Do I hold it? Okay. I'm gonna check out the manual and see how to uh, turn it on. Power on, power on right here. Take out the device carefully from the box and place it on a flat surface. Press and hold the power button until the device says hello humanity. Okay, so I'm gonna press and hold it. Hello humanity, I'm Interstellar Scout K1. Whoa! Whoa! It says control via voice. Let's see. Uh, hey, K1. I'm here. Oh, snap! Woo! Oh, he dances. Go ahead. Go get it. Oh, yeah. Go get it. Look how cool that thing is. What is going on? This is so amazing. Okay, so right here it says I have to install a mobile app. So I'm gonna go ahead and search on my app store to find this app, and it is called K1. It says search K1, all caps. So I'm gonna go ahead and do that real quick. There it is right here. I'm gonna go ahead and click get and install. And since I have an iPhone, it shouldn't take too long at all. So I'm gonna go ahead and hit the screen recorder on my phone so that we can see everything that I'm seeing. So the first thing you'll notice when we jump into the K1 app is the home screen and look how amazing it looks. It's all advanced and everything. I'm going to go ahead and connect to Bluetooth right here by clicking the center button where it says K10000B and the home screen again looks so cool. So let's go ahead and try some action. When you jump into the action screen, I'm going to hit that camera button so I can get a live view of what I'm looking at right there. There's a robot and there's me right there. I want to see him dance so we're going to go ahead and click on Boogaloo right here check it out oh wow now i didn't record with sound on so you don't get the sound so i'll play some music in the background anyway i'll show you a little bit later in the video what it sounds like when he dances and everything let's try one more uh let's go down to mechanical beats let's see what he does here all right now these are all the different dance moves with the live feed of the robot you don't have to have the live feed on a robot it's only if you click that camera button in the bottom left hand corner on the action screen where all the dance moves are, you'll be able to see that. Now we'll go back, there's manual programming and visual programming, which you'll be able to set yourself. Here's the home screen again. If you click that settings icon in the top right, here's all the settings, device, setting, auto shutdown, languages, voice command, there's all the different commands you can get the robot to do. You say, hey one, and then do all that. Here's help and feedback, then the contact us below it, which takes you to the internet. Now, let's see, let's check out the remote control. And again, I'm gonna hit that camera button in the top right corner. And there's a live feed of what I'm looking at. Here he goes. Let's do a left punch, right punch, and double punch. Because those are the choices in the bottom right hand corner. And this is what he does with all those. Pretty awesome. I'm sorry again that there's no sound, but there will be sound later on. If you check it out, just stay tuned for the rest of the video. Now here's the controller. You can get him to go forward. You can get him to move backwards. He's pretty nimble. He has a gyro in him, so he'll be able to stay balanced. He can move to the left and to the right. And I wanted to see if he could actually move, like, diagonally. So this is what you do if you try to move the controller in all different directions. Yeah, he's pretty nimble. It'd be cool. I was only test driving him, so... I He'll probably look way better on the ground, but here he goes again with the double punch. He looks so cool. This is just so amazing. If you hit those two arrows in the right, this screen pops up. Look how cool that thing is. Now I'm going to go back to the home screen again. And there's all these different programmings that you'll be able to set. I'm not sure exactly how to use them yet, but I'm going to be diving more into them as we go along. All these different screens for customization, manual, visual, entertainment. Here's different skills for different talent levels that you'll be able to learn. And here is another programming screen will be where you'll actually be able to set up and like with the robot moving you got to figure out how to make it move and actually program the arms and different moves yourself there's a really cool screen right here you can move that all around sync the robot you go back to the home screen button and hit that worldwide web looking button right there that's what pops up and that's pretty much all there is to it 
Okay, so I'm recording on my screen. Let's see what see what this thing can actually do. I'm so sorry about the coffee pot in the back, but I can't do nothing about that. Let's uh go ahead and hit hit artificial intelligence. Okay. Okay. Oh yeah. Oh yeah. Let's go. That's pretty cool. Okay, it gives you the time. Let's hit boogaloo. Okay, I'm gonna stop. You gotta hit the button again to stop it. So let's hit boogaloo. And he's standing by himself. I'm not helping him at all. This is amazing. Look at this, Nina. Look, check it out. Look at the robot. Okay, okay, that was Boogaloo. We'll try Cyberpunk out. Yeah! All these different dances and stuff. And as you can see on screen right here, there's all these different choices right here. It goes all the way down. There's a lot of different dances, and there's some. There's a lot of different choices right here. There's 3D programming, there's manual programming, there's visual programming. I guess this is a camera you can take pictures. That's cool. Shut off Cyberpunk real quick. This is a remote control. Look at the remote control. This is so cool. Check this out. Let's see. Oh snap! Left punch, right punch, double punch. Double punch! Oh snap! Oh, this is the coolest thing ever. See, you're missing it! Oh, that was so cool. Okay, it's got a little remote control thing too. What the heck? Back up. No, don't fall. Oh my gosh, okay. Back up. Okay, that's how you do it. You gotta let go before you can, uh, before it'll stop, just a little bit before. Oh, that is so cool. That is the basics of the Robosyn K1 Scout Interstellar Humanoid Robot Personal Assistant type device. Super cool. And I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you did enjoy the video, make sure you smash like and again. Leave some comments down below for Lee. He was a dear friend of ours and he would have absolutely loved to see this toy in action. So thank you all again for tuning in. Make sure you stick around, subscribe because we got a lot more cool stuff coming up in 2022. It's gonna be amazing. So I love each and every one of you guys. Mosh Kid out.